Welcome back, it's Martin from Yes I'm a Designer. Let me show you a cool new feature in Adobe InDesign CC 2019. So this is actually a feature or improvement that was introduced both in InDesign and Illustrator and it works exactly the same way. And it will help you a lot when you want to select fonts for your text. So I'm going to select this text here, which is the title of this spread. And then using the new properties panel here in InDesign, I'm going to select the font that's currently being used here. Once I click on this drop down, notice that there's a lot of new features here. So you can obviously get to these features through the character panel as well, or using the control bar, which by the way, in CC 2019 by default is hidden. So you don't see the options here on the top. If you want to get to them, you will have to enable it from the window menu, just simply by selecting control. So just showing it to you. Now we can, of course, from there as well, select these features as long as we have the type tool selected. So when we have our text and the type tool selected, we will also find the font options from here. One of the biggest improvements here is that this dropdown will automatically show you an example of your currently selected text. But of course, you can change this to these other options here as well. So you can even have the full alphabet there and so on and so forth. You can change their sizes. And there's a couple of features that also makes it easier to find relevant fonts. Like you can choose one font that you think would be good, like let's say Babas in this case, and click on the show similar fonts here. Once you do that, you get to a special filtering of all the similar looking fonts on your computer. You can of course still favorite fonts if you want to, and you can get back to seeing all the fonts as easily as that. You can then also filter all the fonts in a very neat way using classification, which would mean like sans serif or serif, but you can also rely on properties like let's say we are looking for lightweight fonts. So we can select that and we immediately get a filtering based on that. Once again, these are all fonts available on your computer. But if you run out of options and you're looking for a font that you currently don't have, you can also click on find more and finally, now you can actually find Adobe Typekit fonts directly from this menu. So you don't have to leave and go on the browser version of Typekit. You can do the synchronization directly within InDesign. So let's just say I'm interested in a different uh, font from here, something that I like, maybe this one. If I just activate this font, uh, which will activate two versions of that. So you can even decide whether you want both the regular and regular italic or just one of them. Let's just, let's say we just uh, activate this one. Once I click OK, it's going to be now synchronized onto my uh, Creative Cloud license. And that means I can select it and use it in my layout. And that's all I wanted to show you in this video. But if you are interested to find out more about the other CC 2019 features, make sure to check back on our channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.